Hello, everybody. Um, welcome to our second part of our Google Tag Manager course. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create your Google Tag Manager and how to implement it to your website. For this example, I'm going to use a website that's in WordPress. Uh, I'm going to show you the logic behind it, but it is still the same with every um, like CMS. Um, Let's start. Let me just okay. So the first things first, you have to go to Google and install your tag assistant. Just type tag assistant Chrome extension and go to here and just download it. Once you download it, it will show up in here. Um, then go to tagmanager.google.com. From there, you have to create. An account for yourself. I'm gonna use each Andarya's website. He is one of our partners for creating websites. He's a brilliant guy with WordPress websites. Let's give this a name. Each Andarya. Country countries Turkey for this example. Let's copy paste his website. You cannot use bashes, so you have to remove this part ecandaria.com we're going to choose a web container okay create yes actually it is that simple as you can see our your google tag manager is already created the hard time and the hard <laughs> the hard stuff starts now okay just copy the first script code it will go to your head section so uh, actually there are two ways to install your google tag manager to your wordpress website the first one is the easy one go to plugins then click on add new under there just type google tag manager and you can install this plugin google tag manager for wordpress it works uh, uh, I'm not going to use this one for this example because I, I want this one to be universal. I want this video to be useful for uh, somebody who uses like custom PHP website. So what you're going to do for the second option is you're going to go to appearances, team file editor. And under there, you're going to find your header. Then under the first line, on their head, you're gonna paste the first code of uh, Google Tag Manager. For the second one, it, it actually says uh, paste this code immediately after the opening body. Let's go to that. Body starts here. So I'm gonna put this code here and update file. As you can see right now, we don't have Google Tag Manager on this website. It is uploaded. Let's re-upload this page. And voila! Our Google Tag Manager is uploaded. It's best with G, J, C. G, J, C. And this is how you implement your Google Tag Manager into your website. Wait, before you go! I'm constantly looking for amazing people to come join our team. So if you're passionate about Google ads and you're passionate about customer success, please go to solate.com forward slash apply. And we'd love to see you as a part of the solutions eight team. Also, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. It lets the YouTube algorithm know that we actually know what we're doing. And uh, don't forget to subscribe. We shoot a video every single day and I don't want you to miss out on any of it. Lastly, if you have questions, comments, concerns, confessions, or you just hate my face and my voice, go ahead and hit us up in the comments. We get very little human interaction, and even the heckling is something that I kind of get a kick out. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you for being subscribers if you're a subscriber. Don't forget to apply if you're interested in working at Solutions 8. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow.